In this module, we will demonstrate how to apply DNA to Gentegra DNA tubes. Start by preparing your purified DNA sample. DNA can be purified using any method and suspended in either water, chiogen buffer, AE, TE, pH 7.5 or pH 8 and low EDTA TE, pH 8.0. You can apply anywhere from 50 nanograms to 5 micrograms of purified DNA to a single Gentegra tube and the DNA should be applied in a volume from 20 microliters to 250 microliters. Gentegra DNA tubes are available in a variety of packages but GenVault recommends beginning with a kit format instead of individual racks. A starter kit includes a rack of 96 Gentegra DNA tubes a 96 position working rack, a 96 position storage rack with barcode, cap mats, hydration solution, a decapper and both positive and negative controls. The positive control contains human DNA which can be used as a rehydration or quantitation control. The negative control is a Gentegra tube with matrix but no DNA sample. It can be used as a rehydration, quantitation or PCR negative control. To begin, remove the lid from the rack of Gentegra tubes by squeezing the corner tabs and the lid from your working rack. The working rack is used to apply sample to your Gentegra tubes without contaminating your remaining unused Gentegra tubes. Using forceps, transfer your desired number of Gentegra DNA tubes to your working rack. In this case, we will do four samples. Using the decapping tool, scoop off the lid from each Gentegra tube and discard. Using a pipetta, aspirate 20 microliters of your DNA in a well-mixed solution at room temperature and dispense into the bottom of the Gentegra DNA tube. Simply pipette up and down six times to mix your DNA with the Gentegra matrix. Ensure that your pipette tip is centered in the bottom of the tube to avoid splashing the DNA on the walls of the tube. Vortexing is not necessary. If necessary, you can centrifuge your rack briefly in a plate centrifuge. Repeat this process as desired until all of your DNA samples have been added to Gentegra tubes. As a reminder, each Gentegra tube has the capacity to store 50 nanograms to 5 micrograms of DNA. Masses above 5 micrograms should be stored in two Gentegra aliquots.